I try to preface working with bands by having a conversation about, look, it's we're not making a good record if there's not some tension, you know, at times. But I need you to know that my entire goal with this whole thing is that the music be the best that it can and I want to serve you guys. I have no ego or agenda. And so don't feel like my ideas are things that we have to do, but also don't throw them away because they're not your ideas. You know, let's work together. And if, if you feel like there's that com- comfortability with the band, um, and, you know, I, I've worked a lot with this Nashville band called Goodbye June that is three cousins, uh, two guitar players and a singer. And then they have a bass player and a drummer, but it kind of changes depending on who's available. And, so when they would come to the studio, all of their ideas were guitar driven. And so a lot of my input on it was, uh, you know, like, this is great, but how do we boil this down to like a, you know, four minute more pop song than your stoner jam that's, you know, 20 minutes long or whatever. <laughs> and, and I say all that to say, and then, coming at it from well let's get let's get a rhythm section vibe happening that really supports what you guys brought in and all I'm doing is finding what's missing in that element kind of the same way that I approach writing songs is if a, if someone comes in and they're really great at melody then I'm going to turn my melody part of me off that day and and work on the lyric and same thing with the producer like if, if a band comes in with a song and it's, like you said, 75% there, well, what is that other 25%? And how do, I, how do I bring that out of the band while making them feel like it was a group effort and not me just, you know, this is how I hear the song, we need to do it. Um, and it can get tricky. I think that, to, to me, the thing is having conversations about... Um, building trust you know a lot of people i think feel like they're indebted to the producer because the producer's taking his time and his life to to give to the project but i kind of look at it with a band like everyone's equal and we're just gonna like even my guys that i'm working with like everyone's input is valid and there's there's no hierarchy per se. It's just us all trying to figure it out. I think that's me coming from a band background of wanting to just, I say a lot of times, maybe the reason why I became a producer is so I can be in a band for six weeks and then quit that band and join another band. (laughs) 